The Earth's unsettling silence. Look around you. Everything you see, everything you touch, everything you know. It's a story told in the blink of an eye. Human history, a fleeting whisper. Your entire life, a breath. But what if I told you that, for unimaginable epochs, this Earth, our home, breathed entirely different air? We are about to step into a silence so profound, it might just break your modern mind. A time where the concept of human was utterly meaningless. A time so distant, it swallows our entire existence whole. Imagine, no distant hum of traffic, no digital glow, not even the smoke from a campfire. This is Earth, 6.1 million years ago. A raw, untamed masterpiece of tectonic forces and ancient weather patterns. The very air you'd breathe would carry different scents. Damp earth, unfamiliar pollen, the musk of creatures we can only now dream of. Continents were settling, yes, but oceans swelled differently. Mountain ranges were younger, and the very air hummed with different life. Geologically, Earth was a restless titan. Volcanic activity was shaping new landscapes and vast forests, particularly in Africa and Eurasia, covered areas that are deserts today. This wasn't a world merely waiting for us. This was the world, complete, self-sufficient, and utterly unaware of the fleeting species that would one day ponder its forgotten glory. So, if there was no human echo, Whose roars pierced the silence? Who navigated these colossal landscapes? The true masters of this era were a spectacular menagerie of creatures, some familiar in form, many utterly alien. This was the age of megafauna that would make today's largest animals look like pets. Imagine colossal elephant-like beasts, their tusks curving downward in a bizarre, unsettling arc. Or giraffes, not just tall, but built like tanks, their heads crowned with bony ossicum. The predators were equally terrifying. Immense, saber-toothed cats, far larger and more agile than any modern predator, sharpening their blades on ancient bone. And beneath the waves, monsters that hunted without fear, their shadows vast against the sun-dappled surface. This was a world of raw, unfiltered competition, every creature a masterpiece of adaptation, locked in a brutal, beautiful dance of life and death. Their reign was absolute, their struggles genuine. And in this grand theater, we were utterly insignificant. But hidden amidst these titans, something extraordinary was stirring. A whisper in the primordial jungle, a ghost of a future that would one day redefine this planet. I'm talking about our ancestor, but here's the mind-bending part. They looked nothing like you, nothing like me, not even like the apes you see today. Picture a creature, perhaps chimpanzee-sized, with a brain no larger than an orange. They moved through dense forests, foraging for fruit, but fossil clues from places like Chad and Kenya reveal something astonishing. The very earliest, tentative steps towards bipedaling. The revolutionary act of walking on two legs. Why? Perhaps to reach higher fruit or to see over tall grasses for predator, or simply to conserve energy. This wasn't a grand conscious leap. It was a series of tiny, almost imperceptible, unpredictable adaptations over millennia. A desperate experiment in survival by creatures with no idea they were laying the groundwork for civilization, philosophy, and interstellar travel. They were just trying to survive the next sunset. The sheer randomness of it, a single, humble adaptation, 6.1 million years ago, leading directly to you. It's almost unsettling. This journey back to 6.1 million years ago isn't just a historical footnote. It's a profound mirror reflecting our own fleeting existence. It reminds us that Earth's story is infinitely grander than our own brief chapter. It teaches us humility. It teaches us that nature, even without our influence, orchestrates incredible dramas of light, death, and spectacular evolution. And it underscores the sheer, improbable luck of our own lineage, surviving those millions of years of countless other species rising and falling. The silent masters, the alien landscape, the unwritten struggle, they shaped the very path that would one day lead to us. So, the next time you look up at the star or simply gaze at a tree, remember the world 6.1 million years ago. A world that didn't need us, a world that began the journey. If this deep dive into Earth's unsettling, pre-human past truly rattled your mind, please like this video, share your thoughts, your awe, your own moments of insignificance in the comments below, and subscribe to journey deeper into the untold stories of our incredible planet. Because the greatest revelations aren't always about the future. Sometimes they're buried millions of years in the past.